Hey guys, Billy Jenkins here with Silver Creek Doodles. Today we're gonna show how we get Mr. Green out of Charlie and Dave's litter ready to go to his new home. So this is our last puppy to leave, is Mr. Green from Charlie and Dave. So what I've already done, he's ready. So we're ready for our, our family to get here. But I wanted to show you guys, we did, took some videos of what we did. So if you can see, he's looking as handsome as ever. So we gave him a bath, blow dried, trimmed his eyes, trimmed his paw pads, trimmed around the, the front of his feet, dremeled his nails, did sanitary trim, all of that stuff. So I just wanted to show you guys what we do and then we'll video a little bit too of when the family comes and picks him up. All right, so we got Mr. Green. We're gonna be getting him ready to go home. So we're gonna show kind of the steps and what we do to get them ready. So we get them all soaked up all the way from around his eyes, his snout, his beard, his chest, down to his feet. But we'll get them all soaked up and then we'll actually rinse it a little bit and then put some conditioner on them because they have hair like us and it does need to be softened. So now we're gonna make sure that we rinse them off and we get everything. So we don't wanna leave any type of shampoo or conditioner or any product left on them. We need to make sure it's clean. <laughs> that we can and then we will towel dry really really good so we're not in a super big rush this morning so we are gonna let him just run around and feel frisky and air dry some but then we will come back and put the blow dryer on him and get him all fluffed up We have bathed and blow dried, and now we are going to do nails before we trim the hair because the nails we want to make sure they're short enough that we round it up. So we actually like to use the Dremel. So what I do is I pull the, the hair back and just round it up. Now the Dremel is going to allow it to not be sharp. It's going to trim it back enough to where he's not going to have sharp nails to scratch. Now you do have to be careful. I've, I've used this thing for many, many years, 10 plus years. So you have to make sure that, you know, you don't catch the hair in there and that, you know, you don't touch them to it. But that's how we like to do the nails. So now, since we have finished with the nails, what we're gonna do is we're gonna get our shavers out and we're gonna shave the bottom of the pads get all the hair that we can. For one, we don't want them to be slippery, but we also don't want them to be tracking stuff in and out. And then next, we will trim the eyes. So next we're going to trim the front of the feet and this is just to make sure that we don't have any scraggly hairs. This is what's going to make it look prim and proper. Now 
not have the Grinch feet. So now we're gonna do his eyes. So I do like to take, so I do my blenders, but I do like to take my ones that just straight cut and do that first, just to get the access out. Done. All right, and then I take my blenders and just try to blend it all in, thin it out. And we do like the tuxedo look, so we're gonna keep as much white in between the eyes as we can. So last thing we got is the booty. We gotta do a sanitary trim in the back. All right, so I put my guards on because I don't want it super short, but I'll hold the tail up and just go up ways. But the last thing that any of our families want is to have poop get stuck back there when they first come home. So we wanna make sure we keep it nice and clean. Billy Jenkins here with Silver Creek Doodles. Today we're gonna show how we get Mr. Green out of Charlie and Dave's litter ready to go to his new home. So another thing that we want to show you that we work with our puppies with, obviously we crate train. So we actually start this anywhere from five and a half to six weeks. And you can see, you know, he's very comfortable in the crate. I've been up and walking around and cleaning the living room and getting the place ready for our family to be here. And he's just hanging out. You a good boy, Mr. Green? Are you a good boy? Oh, I love him so much. You are such a good boy. That is it for Charlie and Dave's litter. And that's how we get a puppy ready to go to their new home the morning of. So we do the bath, nails, trim up the eyes, you know, shave around the feet, do the sanitary trim. We want our puppies to go home, not having to go to the groomer like soon or, you know, within a week or two. We wanna be able to wait, you know, a good four to six weeks. So thank you for watching. If it's your first time here, don't forget to hit that subscribe link. Give us a thumbs up if you like what we're doing and we'll see you next time. Bye.